Good morning there, Summit County. We're taking a look at your newest snowfall in the last 24 hours, along with your weather forecast as we move into the weekend. We're looking at still some pretty consistently chilly conditions. After all, it is late November. It should be expected here in the high country. And the good news is new snow, as I mentioned, five inches over at Arapahoe Basin, 25 inch basin, five lifts over at Breckenridge, brought to you by Visit Breck. One inch of new snow, 29 inch base, 26 trails and six lifts. Then heading over to Copper Mountain, you're going to find two inches of new, 19 trails and six lifts. And stepping over to Keystone, presented by Key to the Rockies. Four inches of new snow in the last 24, seven trails and six lifts operating. Then to round it off with Loveland on the other side of divide, half a foot has fallen along with the 25 inch base. Now you can find there three lifts and 15 trails. Moving outside and seeing what our Friday morning is bringing us plenty of cloud coverage as you can see in the shots brought to you by the outlets at Silverthorne. Lots of this going on throughout the county and that's going to stay for our Friday as well as through most of the weekend, really. Don't expect to see a bluebird day in the next couple of days. But again, we're still going to have some good snow conditions out there. And our national satellite map, you can see a lot of that activity out of the southwest and the entire state is well covered. So expect more snow today. And those chillier uh, conditions are going to persist with this high pressure that's moving out of the way in this next low front is going to come here by the uh, early evening time or late evening for our Friday. Now what's going on for our statewide conditions, looking at highs in the upper 20s, lows, 30s even in the front range. So cold pretty much across state and snow conditions is what we're expecting and heading over to our timberline conditions. High of 16 degrees, 10 20 mile per hour winds and a wind chill of negative one. So what's going on down in town though? You can expect highs in the mid 20s and upper 20s depending on where you are. More snowy, uh, another snowy day for us and, and accumulation is expected to about one to three inches for a three day forecast. We're looking at highs in the upper 20s, lows in the teens, more snow on the way for Sunday and Monday even, and it should be a pretty well good weekend.